In this podcast episode, Suella Braverman, a former Home Secretary and Conservative MP, discusses various issues related to immigration, border control, and human rights. Braverman highlights her background as the daughter of immigrants from Mauritius and Kenya, emphasizing her pride in Britain's historical contributions to civilization. She also explains her conservative beliefs, rooted in values of aspiration, personal responsibility, service, community, family, and fairness. Braverman acknowledges the failure of consecutive governments to lower net migration levels despite promises to the British people. She expresses her disappointment in not being able to implement policies to control immigration during her tenure as Home Secretary. She attributes the lack of progress to political resistance within the cabinet, particularly from economic departments like the Treasury, which prioritize growth over reducing migration. She also points out the influence of the European Convention on Human Rights and the European Court of Human Rights in hindering effective border control measures. Braverman advocates for the UK to leave the European Convention on Human Rights, citing the need to regain control over laws and borders post-Brexit. She argues that the current framework allows for foreign criminals and illegal immigrants to exploit human rights protections to remain in the country, posing risks to public safety and national security. Braverman believes that a UK-specific Bill of Rights enforced by UK judges would better serve the interests of British citizens and address the challenges posed by illegal immigration. Braverman raises concerns about the failure of multiculturalism in certain towns and cities where communities live parallel lives without integrating into British society. She emphasizes the importance of addressing cultural challenges and promoting unity to prevent further divisions within the country. She acknowledges the reluctance of politicians to discuss these issues openly due to fears of being labeled as racist or bigoted, highlighting the need for honest conversations about integration and cultural differences. As a former Home Secretary, Braverman reflects on the state of law and order in the UK, particularly focusing on the challenges faced by the police force. She acknowledges the dedication and bravery of police officers, but points out the lack of public confidence in the police. Braverman believes there has been a disproportionate focus on higher harm crimes, leading to a neglect of lower harm crimes, such as antisocial behavior and vandalism. She advocates for a shift in police resources towards addressing these issues to improve public safety and restore trust in law enforcement. Braverman discusses the handling of protests and extremism by the police, particularly in relation to recent protests against Israel. She criticizes the police for their reluctance to take a tougher approach against hate speech and extremism during these protests, leading to a normalization of anti-Semitic behavior. She believes that a more robust approach is needed to address extremism and maintain public order in the country. The conversation delves into the balance between freedom of speech and hate speech, especially in the context of protests and demonstrations. Braverman emphasizes the importance of protecting free speech while also addressing hate speech and incitement to violence. She raises concerns about the rise of anti-Semitism and extremism in certain protests and calls for a stronger response from law enforcement to prevent such behavior. Braverman highlights the demographic changes in the UK due to migration and the impact on social cohesion. She expresses concerns about the existence of ghettos, lack of unity behind British values, and the appeasement of extremist sentiments. She calls for a re-evaluation of British values, including respect for the rule of law, democracy, fairness, patriotism, and unity to address divisions and promote a cohesive society. 